Today's activity is on matter, solids, liquids, and gases. This is a physically active lesson, so get ready to move. Let's review solids, liquids, and gases. Solids are made of tightly packed molecules. A solid will keep its shape and the molecules are not free to move around. Liquids are made of more loosely packed molecules. They will take the shape of the container they are in. Molecules can move about within a liquid, but they are packed tightly enough that it keeps its volume or shape. Finally, we have gases. Gases are made of molecules packed so loosely that it does not have a defined shape or volume. In this lesson, I will ask questions about states of matter. You will have three choices and each has an exercise that goes with it. Choose your answer and do the exercise that goes with that choice until the answer is revealed. Best of luck. Here's our first question. What is the state of matter where molecules take the shape of its container and have the ability to slowly move around? If you think it's solid, you're gonna start doing mountain climbers. If you think it's a liquid, you're going to do jumps. And if you think it's a gas, you're going to do cross cross. Ready, go. If you were doing jumps, you chose the correct answer. The answer is liquid. Here's our next question. What can change a solid to a liquid? Ice, heat, or gas? If you think it's ice, you'll start doing lunges, heat, arm circles, gas, toe touches. Ready, go. Okay, if you were doing arm circles, you chose the correct answer. The answer was heat. What is it called when a gas changes to a liquid? Is it called condensation, evaporation, or liquidation? If you think it's condensation, you'll do cross crawls, evaporation, lunges, liquidation, mountain climbers. Ready, go. If you were doing cross crawls, you chose the correct answer. That process is called condensation. What is the state of matter where molecules move rapidly? Solid, liquid, or gas? If you think it's solid, you'll do squats, liquid heel raises, and gas jumping jacks. Ready, go. The answer is gas, so jumping jacks was the correct exercise. Liquids have certain properties. Which of the following is not a property of a liquid? Takes the shape of the container it is in, has volume and shape, particles are not free to move around. Whichever of these is not a property of liquid, do that exercise. Arm circles, jumps, or toe touches. Particles are not free to move around is not a property of a liquid. Liquids do move around. What is it called when a liquid changes to a gas? Condensation, evaporation, liquidation. If you think it's condensation, cross crawls, evaporation, lunges, liquidation, mountain climbers. Ready, go. When liquid changes to a gas, it's called evaporation. So lunges was the correct exercise. What is the state of matter where molecules are packed tightly together and have little to no movement? Solid, liquid, or gas? If you think it's solid, you'll do mountain climbers. Liquid, you'll do jumps. Gas, you'll do cross crawls. Ready, go. The answer is solid, so mountain climbers was the correct exercise choice. These next few questions are a little different. I'm gonna give you a picture in the center of the screen and you'll decide whether it's a solid, liquid, or a gas. And you'll do an exercise that kind of mimics what that state of matter is. 
So if it's a solid, you'll stand tall and solid and do heel raises. If it's a liquid, you'll slowly do cross crawls. And if it's a gas, you'll run in place really fast. So let's take a look at our first one. Our first one is juice. If it's a solid, you'll do heel raises, liquid, cross crawls, gas, run in place. Ready, go. Okay, juice is a liquid, so cross crawls was the correct answer. Our next picture is steam. Is it a solid, liquid, or gas? Act out the answer. Go. Steam is a gas, so running in place should have been your movement. Next, we have an orange. Is it a solid, liquid, or gas? Ready, go. Even though an orange has some juice in it, it's a solid. So heel raises was the correct answer. How about a watermelon? Solid, liquid, or gas? Ready, go. Hopefully you got some more heel raises in. Watermelon is a solid. How about car fumes or car exhaust? Is that a solid, liquid, or a gas? Ready, go. That's a gas. This is our last one. How about honey? Is honey a solid, liquid, or a gas? Ready, go. The answer is liquid. Thank you for participating in this active lesson on matter. Keep working and keep moving. Have a wonderful day.